If you guys want the best quality gaming glasses for the lowest prices, make sure you check out nerdscopeglasses.com. Use the link in the description for 5% off. Hello people of the internet, what's going on? I'm the Massive Blade 2. Welcome back to another video. In today's video, we are going to be having a look at the first of the uh, of the Black Friday Squad Builder Challenges. Throughout yesterday, EA... Oh my god, there are more. I didn't realise that. I'm, I'm so well prepared for this video. It's quarter to nine in the morning now. I've just jumped on FIFA. I've come straight here because um, if you guys were on FIFA yesterday, you will have seen that EA released Squad Builder Challenges for Black Friday uh, for two hours um, throughout the day. Yeah, I think I think they only did two in the end. I'm not sure. The, uh, the Unicorn Kit and then the... Oh no, they did three. They did the Mega Pack and then the... Was it the 25k pack? But well, we do have four days to do these, so these are going to be all the Black Friday ones they do. You've got an 82 rated guarantee. Uh, so you get a rare gold player uh, rated 82 to 96, untradeable. So, you know, you've got a chance of getting um, Messi in for Ronaldo. Uh, a Team of the Week guarantee, so you get uh, an inform from Team of the Week 10. A team of the Week tradable, so you get um, a player from this Team of the Week. Uh, which is tradable and then um, I think these ones are pretty self-explanatory you get three players from the league which are all untradable so you know if you end up getting yourself a Messi from uh, the La Liga one he's not going to be tradable but I do like the look of these um, so we are just going to jump into the first one the 82 rate guarantee and I haven't seen anything on um, these as I say I've just jumped straight on um, so it may take me a little while so requirements for this it has to be exactly gold we need at least seven rare players at least 30 chem and a full team so what I'm thinking straight away is going with the uh, the league of BBVA you get you've got quite a few um, rare players in there which are cheap and you know what it doesn't give a minimum rating so you could go with really low rated players for example typically i spent all my coins um last night oh and i can't even remember what uh an informed cerner that's it um so just look for um cheap rare goalkeepers um i'm not sure which of these are rare but um, i will jump on the market and find myself one Alright guys, so uh, we've got the choice of Asenjo and Roberto, and well there, there are quite a few, there are four on that page, four different ones, so um, let's just go with, um, let's just go with Roberto, I guess. Right, there we go. Alright guys, so we have got um, Roberto in net. Um, let's go ahead and look again at the uh, La Liga Santander. Um, Garay, I know, is pretty cheap. In fact, let's look at my club. I must have some in my club. Yeah, here we go. My goal, how much should I buy you for? 850. Alright, you can go. Lemos I want to keep, because that partnership of him and Jimenez is deadly. Um, right, who else is cheap? We've got... You ideally want to be going for slower players, so... Um, I doubt any of these down here are going to be rare. So let's go with Ruiz. Ruiz is rare. Um, and then you know what this this may not be the best league to go for players can be quite expensive I mean look at that he, he will be going for about 700 coins but probably a bit later on um, in time about the 40th minute alright so I've got 4 rare players there we need 3 more rare players Alright, let's go with Nasri. I know Nasri goes for absolutely nothing. Um, 
you do want to look for slower players, so this Mosquera guy and probably yeah, Gomez. Gomez won't be going for anything. Uh, right. Oh, look at this. A right mid with 54 pace. And then uh, you're going to want to put a couple of rare players in here, so Sacedo. So I do have on loan, but uh, obviously I'll go out and buy because you can't use loan players. Um, Soldado, there we go. No one, no one wants Robert Soldado in the team, do they? And then uh, Ganzo, I know he's rare. So that should be done, there we go. So um, I'm going to go out and buy all these players now. And uh, then be back once I've completed it to open the pack. Alright guys, so here we are. As you can see, I have made a few changes. I did end up getting rid of um, Garay, Ruiz, Nazri, and then one one of the other centre mids from the non-rares. No, both are non-rares, sorry. But, um, this is a team, it, it costs around 650-700 players for... Every player, Mangala, I already had. Um, I'm sure he'll be pretty cheap right now. Let me just double check. If he is uh, going for a bit more than you guys can afford, then there are cheaper alternatives. I just already had him, and I don't really use him. So, um, yeah, here we go. Going to cost you about 7k to do this. Um, that's what it cost me anyway. So, if you do it right, then you will get yourselves the um, untradeable... 82 plus rated guarantee pack so um, we're gonna jump over to the store and um, I'm gonna open this if I could get something good then all right I don't think that's a walkout no that's, that's a, oh don't tell me that's terrible oh my I've just paid 7k for Gary Cahill Oh my god. I mean, I'll take him. I can use him for the squad building challenges, but... No, I... I, I wouldn't recommend doing this, guys. Oh, hang on. This is repeatable. They're all repeatable. Damn. So you could... You know, if you had enough teams, you could just do this until you get yourself an informed Ronaldo. So, um, no. Would I recommend this to you guys? Absolutely not. You've got... There are so many more, you know, low-rated players that go for absolutely nothing than uh, high-rated players that you're likely to get. And paying, you know, 7k for a Gary KL is just not worth it. But anyway, if you guys uh, did enjoy, make sure you leave a like, subscribe if you haven't already. Thanks for watching. You guys are the best.